because I want to show you where I am in Green Lake. I'm on North 80th and Wallingford. Let me show you my view. And now, and we're going to start moving here. You can see on the other side here is a bus, which has got one of those traffic triangles on the road in front of it. Its hazard lights are flashing. And as we work our way alongside of it here, you'll see this is one of those articulated buses. It's just been sitting here for about the last, well, 25 minutes that we've been in this neighborhood. That is the second articulated bus that we've seen get stuck so far. The other one we saw was in the U District. We are now in Green Lake. In fact, straight ahead of me, that's Green Lake Drive. And it, can you see the two people, or at least one of them, on cross-country skis there in the intersection? She just stepped up onto the curb. And think about this for a moment. It is a glorious Saturday morning here. And a lot of people here have the right idea. Let's get a closer look at what she's doing there on those cross-country skis just surveying the landscape and about to head out on what will be a gloriously peaceful Saturday. Peaceful for her because she's not getting in the car. And I can tell you from our experience, if you're getting in the car, don't expect every road to look as easy as this one. This is a major thoroughfare. Again, we're on North Green Lake Drive. To my right, I'm looking out over the water. And this is a road that has been plowed because it's a major thoroughfare. The road we were on a second ago was an example of one that had also been plowed. But as soon as we turn off onto some of these more residential streets, especially here on the north side of Green Lake, and we are just on the very northern edge, just as you start to get into that real um, quaint part of the district and the hills, that's my point. And of course, as King 5 Storm King starts to make its way up the hill here, we're interrupting the sledders. Can you see the group up here with their bright yellow sled and somebody else on cross-country skis that was just ready to come down this hill? That's the neighborhood we are in, and we'll take this short roundabout. There's about three and a half to four inches of snow on the ground here, and this is a road I believe we're probably the first vehicle to take this roundabout yet this morning because I'm not seeing tracks on this and of course Storm King can handle this easily it's a large four-wheel drive vehicle if you're in anything other than that you're gonna have a tough go of it here 